Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Emma and welcome to Emma Jane. So today's video is going to be a teeny tiny little Primark haul. Just kidding. It's going to be an absolutely ginormous one instead if that's okay. So before we get into the video, make sure you have hit the big red subscribe button. I'll put an annotation here so you can just click that as well. This will keep you updated on my new content so that you're notified of when that goes up. Also give this video a big thumbs up if you love Primark hauls as much as I do. And let's just get into it. So everything I picked up in this haul, I picked up from the Primark by the Tottenham Court Road station. And uh, it's quite a lot really. Um, they actually gave me like three bags, like one big one and three little ones. Uh, it was packaged really nicely though, so I'll uh, dive in and show you what I got. I'll start with the clothes and then move on to the homeware and accessory things that I picked up. So the first thing I've picked up to show is these white jeans. This is them. They are just skinny mid-rise denim jeans. I got these in a size 8. They fit really nicely, um, they're skinny, normal skinny jeans really. Um, they're a little bit see-through, but I figured I can wear some nude coloured underwear that will kind of make that not very visible. Um, I really wanted a pair of white jeans for the summer, I think they look really nice with a the tan. These were only £7, so if I spill something on them it's not the end of the world. Next up is one of my favourite things I think, it is absolutely adorable and it cost me £7 as well but this is a little t-shirt that says Team Minnie on it and Minnie Mouse is my favourite Disney character, she has always been my favourite for as long as I can remember and I just love this, it's adorable, it made me want to go to Disney so bad but it is so nice, the material is so soft and I just thought this would be an absolutely lovely top to kind of lounge around the house in and just relax in. So I did seem to pick up a lot of white things on this trip. So the next thing is white, um, but it is this really pretty chiffon-y style cami top. It's got a big plunging black V and it's got little um, triangles of black up the sides. Um, I really like this. I really love wearing my plain white ones of these and I just thought I needed something that was just a little bit different to mix it up a little bit and this was really beautiful. So I really wanted to buy two of these so that I could wear them one on top of the other so that it wasn't as see-through. But when I went back to get another one after trying it on, I realised they were £8 and um, I couldn't quite justify £16 for one top which is what it would have been because I would have worn them together. So I just got the one and figured I can just wear one of my other ones underneath it to stop it being so sheer. Guess what guys, it's something that's white as well. So this is absolutely beautiful. This costs seven pounds and it is just this really light white jumper with this absolutely gorgeous cutout detail on the shoulders. I thought this would be really lovely to wear on kind of evening where it's a little bit too chilly to just wear like a t-shirt, but you wanted something a little bit heavier to cover your shoulders and arms. Now the next thing, it's white. This I saw a couple of weeks ago when I was just browsing around the store, I wasn't buying anything. It cost five pound and it is this t-shirt. It's white, it's got like, arrow print on it, got little sleeves and it's actually a really nice texture, it's got like, I don't know how to explain it, almost camo but like white camo and uh, it's really pretty, it's really comfortable, again I thought it'd be lovely for just kind of lounging around the house and uh, being comfortable. Now the final item of clothing that I bought was this dress, this cost Eight pounds. Everything was eight pounds, or like seven, seven or eight pounds. It's got this really pretty blue floral print, and then at the bottom it's got a red stripe with a different floral print on it. And this is just kind of like a swing dress. I had one of these last year in black, and I really liked it. So I decided I wanted to pick up another one, and uh, I really liked this pattern. It's really pretty. Again, really easy to wear while on holiday. Now the thing that everyone wants to talk about socks. I picked up the three seamless footsie cushioned sole socks. These I have been loving. I picked up a pack of these, oh, maybe a month ago, and I have honestly been wearing them non-stop. They are great for wearing with like ballet shoes, like little dolly shoes, um, and things that you don't want socks to like poke out. 
and these ones with the cushion, they've got little cushiony pads, are so comfortable, they're so nice and uh, I am super excited to have some more because a couple of mine did break and these for three were £2.50 so so cheap. The next thing I bought I really did not need and I was hating myself when I picked it up but I love it so much, I saw it and was like oh my god I need that in my life and that is the Primark Double Duvet Cover. Um, it's this really gorgeous one, it's got a leafy, leafy that's not leaf, it's got a nice little feather pattern and one side is this cream colour and the other side is this blue colour, it's absolutely beautiful and I just thought it was really nice and really summery and who doesn't love new bedding? And that was £11 and to go with that I picked up these pillowcases, these were £2.50 and they are just little arrows on white and I just thought they would look really nice against the feathers as kind of like the second pillow because everyone has two pillows. I then picked up a couple of candles while I was in the homeware section. I got two of each of them so I'll just show you one. The first one I got was this uh, salted coconut candle and it's got this really beautiful metallic bottom and then like a really dark blue top. Oh it smells amazing. And I just thought these would look really beautiful on our bedside tables. And these were, how much were you? £3.50 each. So I picked up two of them. I then also saw these beautiful candles. These are the Zen Lemon Sun Orchid. Oh my god, it's so fresh. It smells amazing. These were £4 and they are just these beautiful gold. Gold, it's gold, it's just gold. And I, again, I thought these would look really beautiful on our bedside tables and in the background of videos. The last few pieces of homeware, I picked up some LED lights. I got 40 indoor ones and 20 little heart ones. These ones are absolutely beautiful, but I'm a bit concerned that it's copper. Ooh, I'm dropping things. I'm a bit concerned that the like copper wire just goes all the way through. But I thought, again, uh, both of these would look really beautiful in the background of videos. Get them up behind me to kind of brighten it up back there a little bit, and it would have been a little bit more exciting. Now on to some accessories. I picked up two lots of hair bows. These were both £1.50 each and they're both the same style, so with the little bows on them like this. So I've got a coral and a really beautiful teal colour and then a pretty blue and a kind of pinky floral. I love wearing these to work, I have to have my hair in a ponytail when I go to work and adding just something like this just makes it a little bit nicer and uh, I'll be honest, people tip me more when I wear bows, so... Oh, I forgot something. I forgot to show you something from earlier. So I picked up a pair of boots. These were £18, so I feel like their prices are creeping up slowly, um, but this is them. These were from the Wide Fit section. They are just these beautiful tan colour boots with buckle detailing and a nice big chunky sole. I absolutely love them. I actually wore out my favourite pair of Primark boots. I have been looking for a replacement ever since. And these are so similar to them. The heel is slightly chunkier and obviously the details are different in the buckle. But I'm super excited, these are going to be so comfortable. I'm going to wear them into death and I'm so excited to wear them because they are beautiful. So, two more accessories. When I came home and showed Jack these, he did not like them in the slightest. But I really like them, so I want you guys to tell me what you think in the comments below. So next up I picked up two lots of sunglasses. And like I said, Jack hated both of them when I showed them to Why? him. <laughs> you did! So the first pair is this pair of aviators. They've got really beautiful floral sides and then on the front they're just kind of in a bit of a gradient. And these ones were three pound. And uh, this is what they look like. I think they look all right. Obviously, they're a little bit big, but they're fine. For three pounds, you know, just like, oh, look, I'm wearing sunglasses, oh. And they came with a really pretty sunglasses bag. That is just, you know, the same floral as the size of sunglasses. If I break a pair like this, I don't care as much as if I break my expensive pair. I really like them. The next pair I got were four pounds, so a little bit more expensive, and they are this pair. They remind me of the Dior ones that everyone's loving at the moment, and uh, I really like them. I really like the reflectiveness. I really like the bar over the top. They're a little bit big, but this is what they look like. I think they look really dramatic and cool, and I 
feel cool when I wear them. But definitely let me know which one you prefer. Obviously, these are a little bit big as well, so I keep slipping down my face. But if I do know, lying in the sun, that's not going to happen. So my final three things are some of my favourites. And uh, I get these pretty much every time I go to Primark. So I picked up two of the coconut chips. I love these so much. They are delicious. If you haven't had these, go to your local Primark and grab some. If they have the chocolate ones, get them. But these ones are just as good. And then I also picked up the banana chips. I love these as well. I just like having this like healthier alternative to like chocolate and sweets in the house and these obviously you know they've still got sugar and stuff on them but they the crunch and the crispiness of them is just so yummy they are just oh my god i love coconut i love coconut so much and they're so more so that is everything that i picked up from primark i hope you enjoyed this video let me know in the comments below which item is your favorite and what you want the most from Primark. Also, like I said earlier, don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that you keep up to date with my videos. There'll be a annotation on the screen and uh, you all know where it is anyway. Then give this video a big thumbs up to let me know how much you like Primark hauls. Don't forget you can also follow me on all my other social media. The links are on screen now as well as in the description bar. I hope you all have a wonderful week and I'll see you next time. Bye. I went to Superdrug twice, uh, probably in the past two weeks, and picked up some stuff. There are some real great things in Superdrug at the moment, and they have some great deals on as well. There are also a couple of boots things, and a couple of things I got while I was in duty free. So I'll show you those things first, and then go on to the Superdrug bits and bobs. So How do I look? Stevie. I think they look good. <laughs> it's not you, I'm cool. Stevie. You're Stevie. I look cool. Right now I look cool. It's like hair, it's like lipstick, it's just like oh.